What is happening to our earth? Increasing emission of greenhouse gases, excessive floggings, forest fires. It's climate change and it will get worse if we don't do anything about it. Hi, I'm Anisha Fia. My name is Rash Dafira. I am Mama Takif. My name is Alia Shafika. I am Siti Aisha and we are from MRSM Batu Pahat, Johor. Nearly all land areas are seeing more hot days and heat waves. 2020 was one of the hottest years on record. While fires start more easily and spread more rapidly when the conditions are hotter. Changes in temperature cause changes in rainfall. This result in severe and frequent storms. They cause flooding and landslides, destroying homes and communities, and costing billions of dollars. The oceans soak up most of the heat from global warming. This melt ice sheet and rises sea level, threatening coastal and island communities. The ocean also absorbs carbon dioxide, keep it from the atmosphere. More carbon dioxide make the ocean more acidic, which endanger marine life. Climate change poses risks to the survival of species on land and in the ocean. These risks increase as temperature climb, forest fires, extra weather and invasive space and diseases are among many threats. Some species will be able to relocate and survive, but others will not. As we know, the main factor of climate change is the greenhouse effect caused by additional emission of greenhouse gases by human activities. So how exactly do we construct climate change? By changing to renewable energy. Hydropower energy also called hydroelectric power or hydroelectricity is a form of energy that harnesses the power of water in motion such as water flowing over a waterfall to generate electricity Biomass energy is energy generated or produced by living or once living organisms The most common biomass material used for energy are plants such as corn and soy the energy from these organisms can be burned to create heat or convert it into electricity. Heat that is generated within the earth, chill means earth, and thermal means heat. It is a renewable resource that can be harvested for human use. Yes, rather, this will create crucial environmental, social, and economic benefits. Global dependence on oil, natural gas, and coal, and the damage this dependence inflicts is well documented. But a transition away from fossil fuels is in progress and simply needs to be expedited. 